Hello, I'm LCZ, and in this video, I'll be showing you how to install 6.61 Adrenaline firmware onto your PS Vita. Adrenaline lets you play all things PSP, ranging from PSP games to PSP homebrew. Let's get started, shall we? Now, the first thing you want to make sure of is to make sure that you are eligible to use Henkaku. Next is to install a PSP demo or game. I will repeat again, it can be a PSP demo or a PSP game. The demo that I am using today is Loco Roco Midnight Carnival Demo. This is the only way the hack will work only if you have a PSP demo or PSP game. Next, reboot your PS Vita device and head to beta.henkaku.xyz. This is Tai Henkaku, which allows the 6.61 PSP firmware to be run. Next, head in the molecular shell, not Vita shell, and press start. From there, you will see a list of five options under Henkaku settings. Turn Unsafe Homebrew on. It will prompt the menu, accept, and close the application. If it does not let you close the application, press start again, go down to power, and reboot. This means you will have to head to beta.henkaku.xyz again and load the hack. Switch to Vita Shell and press select, which should pull up a menu with an IP address and a port on the end. Now head to your computer and open up an FTP client, such as what I'm using today, FileZilla. After that, open up a web browser, such as Google Chrome. Once it boots up, the first thing we want to do is to head to Adrenaline's GitHub. Scroll down to the bottom to the link that says download. Once you go to the link, download the zip file. In the zip file, there will be a folder that says adrenaline. Put that on your desktop. Now, go back into your web browser and head to the PSP 6.61 firmware download page on Sony's official website, which will be linked in the description. Once the .pbp has finished downloading, rename it to 661.pbp. Open your FTP client back up and navigate to UXO slash PSPEMU. Drag the adrenaline folder that was on your desktop into the Vita folder. Now, inside of that adrenaline folder that is now on the PS Vita, drag your named 661.pbp file into the Adrenaline folder that is on the PS Vita. For one of the final steps on the computer, navigate to UXO slash TAI, or TAI. In there, you will find a file that says config.txt. Drag that to your desktop, and after you drag it, delete the one in your Vita currently. Go into the document and paste the code that is in the description into the next free line of code. Where it says star title ID, change that to your game ID that you have installed on your Vita currently. The code for Loco Roco Midnight Carnival Demo is NPUG80318. After you've done that, save and pop the config file back into the Vita system. All work is done on the computer, now let's move to the Vita. Start off by rebooting your Vita and go to the website beta.henkaku.xyz once your system has finished booting up. The reason we do this is to re-enable Tai Henkaku. After that, it's a matter of launching your PSP game and pressing X when it asks you if you want to install. Once that happens, code is going to fly all over the place and for me, it took about one minute. Once that's done, press X and it should boot you up into the PSP setup menu. You should have to set it up like a normal PSP, but once you do, you can go to the settings to check the version, which should be 6.61 Adrenaline. To install games that you legally own, go into UXO slash PSPEMU slash PSP. Create a new folder called ISO and put your PSP's ISOs in there. Boot up Adrenaline and go into your games folder you should see your new ISO games in there. Okay guys, that wraps it up. I'm gonna go install my all-time favorite PSP game, Tony Hawk's Underground 2 Remix. So I'll see you guys later. Have fun in the meantime. See ya!